Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks so much for tuning in to another video. For any new people, my name's Johnny and on this adventure I've got my little brother Danny along for the ride as well. So this time Danny and I explore Cape Palmerston National Park. This place is seriously epic and being situated in the Mackay region it really has a cool North Queensland feel about it. I'll just quickly mention to you guys that if you do like the video and enjoy some of the other content we've been putting out, it would really mean the world to me if you could subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and leave the video a thumbs up if you feel like doing so. You can also jump over to our Instagram account at earth.focus or our Facebook page to keep up to date with our adventures. Also, keep your eyes peeled on the socials for a cheeky little giveaway of a double swag that I'll be doing shortly as I really want to be able to give back to you guys. Anyway, we'll get on with the video. Thanks so much for tuning in. I really hope you enjoy it. So initially we got to camp pretty late the night before and stayed at the first available campsite once we entered the park. As soon as we woke up the next morning we were greeted by this absolutely stunning pebbly beach right in front of camp. We couldn't see any other people around and there was next to no tyre tracks on the beach. It had a very remote feel about it. As nice as this camp was we were keen to pack up and keep moving forward as our original goal was to camp at the Cape Creek camping zone which was situated a little bit further north. So we had some brekkie packed up and started heading towards Cape Creek hoping to find some sheltered waters where we could launch the tinny. Welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for joining us on our latest adventure. This time we're at an absolutely epic location. Heading out for a fish. Just around this pointy up to the creek. Got camp here, sick little spot. Go left here, mate. Super strong, eh? This looks sick, though.
put the boat in for the morning. We've, we've put it in right in front of our campsite. That's camp just over here. So we're gonna go check our pots that we left out yesterday afternoon. And then yeah, see what else we can find. See if there's any fish around. So there's some pretty big tides around here. They're around five meter tides. So on a low tide, this whole bank is just a big sand bank. And on a high, it comes in and we're able to launch here. And we can get out a bit easier and access the ocean a bit a bit quicker. Nice mate, got it going. into this little this little leg that runs off the creek so we'll have a few casts hmm. so nice oh you see that yeah you just speak? yeah We've been pushing further and further up this creek, fishing it, probably fished it for about the last hour or more. Um, and it keeps on going. We haven't got any fish yet, but we'll keep on pushing up a bit further and see if we can get onto anything. It looks really, really nice around here. Really nice deep drop-offs, lots of mangroves, real snaggy. So we'll keep going and see how we go. We've left the creek and pulled up into this bay here. We've um, parked the boat just around the corner. The tide's a little bit lower this time around, so we've left it up around the tip. And I'm just running back to camp. We're gonna grab some heavier rods and try head out and look at these islands. So there's these, there's some couple, a few islands up the back here. And that wind's died down. Well, I'm hoping it's died down enough for us to get out there and see if we can find some reefs, see if we can troll around these islands and these headlands and stuff. So yeah, we're gonna get out of the creek and go into the ocean. That's the beauty about this spot, it's so nice. You can go fish those beautiful little creeks and then you can duck out into the ocean and hopefully troll up some mackerel, but we'll see how we go. <laughs> 